kids today we will start a new subject that is computer application in business this is for bcom final year students of dusol and uh, first we will discuss the format of the question paper uh, your question paper is divided into two parts part a and your part b the very first question asked by the examiner from part a is your true and false uh, there are in total four questions first is true and false and the rest three questions include two questions that means you are required to write six questions uh, if you have any notebook just write it down because uh, the questions which i'm gonna tell you uh, are asked generally from this part okay so the questions are your uh, question number one is types of computers uh, according to types of computer according to the size and according to the purpose next is your difference between general purpose software and tailor made software uh, next question is your meaning of internet and its impact on society your different type of operation in ms excel uh, and your search engine the questions based on search engine uh, and your internet protocol then the questions related to operating system your uh, type of alignment in word document and the uh, and one or two questions related to ms excel or workbook uh, the question related to your this uh, hardware and software differentiate between hardware and software okay so i'll explain the answers of some of the questions which i have just told you uh, next comes your section b it includes three questions and out of three the last two questions include two two parts one question of theory and your one uh, question is calculative normally students leave this uh, these calculation based questions these calculation based questions are considered quite confusing and tough because the answers in the tenure is also wrong uh, then your uh, now i'm gonna tell you the theory questions which are generally asked from this section the theory questions are your this uh, um, syntax of statistical function syntax of financial function or syntax of logical function in ms excel this question is very important so please prepare it well and the next question which is generally asked is your count count a and count if function then uh, the question your ratio analysis and its type that's it uh, from calculation part uh, four questions are given and uh, out of which you are required to do only two questions the four questions are your table for frequency distribution number two is your table for regression analysis number three loan and lease statement and number four is your generalized payroll statement okay now let us discuss some important questions uh, you can see in the video the questions are here the first question is your computer based on the size according to the size according to the size computers are like your super computers mainframe computers your mini computers workstations and your microcomputers so i'm going to explain it one by one supercomputers widely used in scientific applications they are most uh, powerful computers used for complex calculations and they are uh, due to their size and expense and they are used by government agencies and large businesses then comes your mainframe computers they are usually slower less powerful less expensive than supercomputers they are used by bank and business to update inventory etc now your mainframe computers can support hundreds or thousands of users handling massive input output and storage now your uh, this uh, mainframe computers are used in large organization where many users need access to shared data mainframe computers are also used as e-commerce servers and handling transactions over internet then your mini computers they are smaller than micro computer mainframe computers and general purpose computers it is generally easier to use and they usually have multiple terminals they may be used as network or internal servers then uh, workstations it's your uh, it is powerful single user computers used for task like product design and computer animation and it is often used as network or internet server then comes your micro computer and personal computer they are smallest and least expensive they have smallest memory and less power they are physically normal 
smaller and permit less peripherals to be attached and they are more commonly known as personal computers. The term PC is applied to IBM PCs or compatible computers and disco, uh, desktop computers are most common type of PC. Notebook that is your laptop also. These computers are used by people who need the power of desktop and portability and handled PCs such as PDAs lack the power of desktop or notebook PC offer limited uh, fluctuations or smaller size and your examples of this kind of uh, computers are your personal computers, desktop, laptop, palm top, PDA. So this was question one which was asking you about the computers according to their sizes. Okay. Next question is your differentiate between hardware and software. First I'll tell you about the hardware then software. In hardware you can see hardware is physical parts of the computer are called hardware. You can touch, see and feel hardware. Hardware is constructed using physical materials or components. Computer is hardware which operates under the control of a software. If hardware is damaged it is replaced with new one. And hardware is not affected by computer viruses and user cannot make new duplicate copies of hardware. In case of software, it is a set of instructions given to the computer is called software. Then you cannot touch or feel software. Software is developed by writing instructions in programming language. The operations of computer are controlled through software. If software is damaged or corrupted, its backup copy can be reinstalled. And software is affected by computer viruses. User can make new duplicate copies of the software. So this was the differentiate between the hardware and software. So this is it for this video. And we will see more questions of theory in the next video. Thank you. And if this video helped you in any way. So please do like the video and subscribe the channel for more videos. Thank you.